velvet caviar. Baby, y'all know y'all my hearts. Y'all my hearts. But can y'all please make cases that Lifestyle, vlogs, unboxing, and reviews. You in the right place. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe below because I do post once a week. That's every Thursday at 9 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. So, 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 so. If y'all click on today's video, y'all already know I'm coming back today with a one month of dedication review from Delta Caviar Sherbet Stars Edition for my iPhone 15 Pro Max and my AirPods Pro 2. I am super excited to give y'all an updated review on this case because I had so much nice stuff to say about it. And do I still have something nice to say about it? Continue watching so y'all can find out later. If y'all do want to go ahead and get 30% off for of your first Daily Caviar case purchase, go ahead and use my link down below so you can get 30% off. Also, if you want to go ahead and get anything in this video, you can go ahead and use the link down below in the description box. So if y'all interested in anything I just said, go ahead and stay tuned. But before we go ahead and get into today's video, do not forget to go ahead and give uh, this video a huge thumbs up because it does let me know what y'all are interested in this type of content here on my channel and y'all definitely try to see some more in the future. So let's not waste the time. Let's go ahead and hop right into today's updated review. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this box on the scene. And this is how this case has held up over the course of one month. Let's go ahead and get some close-ups of this case before we hit and get into some more of the details. So first things first, it does not look like the case has changed colors, which is awesome because y'all know how it is with anything pink from Velvet Cap. Y'all, y'all know the vibes, so I don't need to do too much. Let's see if there's any scratches. Let's get a focus. So I'm not sure how well y'all could see it right here, but it is a little scratched right here. It, there is a lot of, yeah, it's real dusty. Ooh, it's dusty right here. Don't, don't, don't man, that, that, that don't count. But um, I do see a lot of minor scratches. But like at a glance, looking at it like this, I can't say like, oh my god, it got so scratched up, it looks so terrible. Like I don't feel like that. But it is scratched up slightly. The design has not faded, chipped, or did none of that, which is a plus. That's one thing I could say about velvet caviar cases. The designs of the cases never ever fade. Now, don't y'all know how some cases like I go, wow, you use them. It begins to fade and start looking all funky looking. Velvet caviar cases never do that. One thing I can say that their cases mainly do is change colors, which is something that I talk about in all of my updated case review videos because that's one of the main things I know I look for personally, and I'm pretty sure a lot of my hearts out there look for that too. And y'all already know I'm always here to get y'all the real, the raw, and uncut. Baby, this video is not sponsored. I'm not paid to do this. So I'm not paid to tell y'all these things. Like, I'm telling y'all the truth from my, you know, point of view. So, um, yes. I hate how hard <clears throat> it is to take these cases off of the AirPods. And I feel like people don't talk about it enough. And I'm gonna be the one to tell y'all, if y'all have never purchased an AirPods case from Velvet Caviar, uh, it's hard to take these off. Like, I always have to get a butter knife and I have to wrap the butter knife up in something and kinda like, let's see if we can get this to focus. I have to literally like push the AirPods out of this case and I always dent up the bottom. Well, I'm not gonna say always. The bottom of my AirPods are dented up just very slightly from the pressure I have to do, the pressure I have to use in order to get it off of this case. So that's something that I feel like y'all should know before y'all get this if y'all have not purchased from them before. 
Now, my final thoughts. Do I feel like this case is worth the money after one month of solid usage? Absolutely. This case, okay. This case is so freaking cute, y'all. Like, I got so many compliments on it. Everybody loved it. It pops, especially if your favorite color is pink, which y'all already know, pink is one of my favorite colors. So, you know, it's definitely worth the money. And if y'all do wanna go ahead and get the AirPods case, you can go ahead and use my link down below in the description box to get 30% off of your first Veil & Carrier case purchase. So, with that being said, let's get ready and hop right into the phone case and the next clip. Let's go ahead and put this box on the scene. And this is how this phone case has held up over the course of one month. Let's go ahead and get some close-ups before we get into some more of the details. Look at that. Look at this logo. All right, y'all already know the first thing I'm gonna say. Look at this. Terrible, capital T, terrible. But you know what? I'm not gonna get up on here and make it seem like I'm just so shocked and so, well I am heartbroken, broken. Heartbroken, I am, because I hated that this case changed colors, but I would be lying to y'all if I told y'all I didn't know that it was gonna do that. Velvet caviar. Baby, y'all know y'all my hearts. Can y'all please make cases that don't change colors? Like, I don't even think I'm asking for a lot. This case, before any discounts, is 40 bucks. $40. Most people out here are not even spending that much money on these cases. On cases, period. So, with me being an avid Velvet Caviar case customer, I feel like I'm owed cases that don't change colors. Like, uh, or do y'all feel like I'm asking for too much? Cause this is this is ridiculous. And you know what? I know when I got this, and I'm not even trying to like go on a rant or nothing, cause y'all know I love Velvet Caviar, and I'll be lying to y'all if I told y'all I'm not gonna buy no more cases from them, cause y'all know I am. But I would be lying to y'all if I didn't tell y'all that I just really feel a way. It's like, bro, I spent all this money on these cases, and it's just like it's. It don't be given after a while. And that's why I went against my better judgment and got this case when I knew it was gonna change colors. That's why I love the cases with the darker colored borders because they, if they do change colors, you don't know because the border is not a light color. So there's that. So let's get into some more of the details. As y'all can see, when I first got this, this was pink, baby, pink. It's giving cherry right now. Like it's giving like, if I didn't know that this was pink when I got it, I, I wouldn't know. Because the way that it looks now, like what's going on? Granted, I have been sliding this in and out of my work pants, which I wear black pants to my job, which I have two jobs, y'all. I work, I wear black pants to both of my jobs. And I'm pretty sure that's not helping the situation, but at the same time for $40, it shouldn't be charged gold, I'm just saying. So let's see if there are any scratches. The back of this case is a little, maybe I should have wiped it off before this video, but this regard like little stains that you can wipe off. But as y'all can see something like this, the back of this case is indeed um, slightly scratched up as well, which once again, I'm not surprised about, you know. Um, the borders, the borders. The borders have changed color, which once again, I'm not surprised about. But as y'all can see, the borders are brown. So there's that. The buttons are brown. So there's that. The inside of the case, however, still looks pretty good. Granted, I haven't really took the phone out of this case since I got it over like a month ago. Well, I'm lying, I took it out for a little while, but most of the time it's been on my case, been on my case. Most of the time it's been on my phone, so I'm not gonna say I never took it off because I definitely took it off for a few days. But still in all, this is how it's looked, you know, after having it for a month, and the inside still looks new. But this right here, I just, I just, Oh my God, any of 
the previous hearts watching my video, I know y'all probably thinking like, Erin, you knew it was gonna do this. You knew, we knew that was gonna happen. But that don't make seeing it better. It still sucks to see it like this because this case was so freaking cute when I first got it. <laughs> now it's giving hand-me-down. Now it's just giving hand-me-down, y'all. And honestly, after one month of solid usage, would I recommend the case? Uh, yes and no. Yes, because it's still cute. No, because it changed colors. Now, let me get this out before, you know, I finish it up. I want to say everybody may not be as critical as I am when it comes to cases, you know, changing colors, getting scratched up, etc., etc. But, me personally, you know... I'm gonna have to, um, you know, not get cases with bright colored borders from Velvet Caviar again, no matter how freaking cute they are, cause they still get fun. They actually have a new case out. It's like some type of like eyes, like with eyelashes and just so freaking cute. But looking at the color of it, it just seems like a situation waiting to happen. And y'all know what I mean. So, would I recommend it? Like I said, y'all heard what I said. Yes and no. It really just depends on, you know, how you want to toss it up, baby. So, if y'all do want to get this, I will link a code down below or a link down below where you can get 30% off of your first Velvet Carrier case purchase. So, this is how both of them are looking together. Which, I guess, maybe at a distance, it really don't look bad. But it's just like when you start getting close up on it, it's like what's going on right here, what's going on right there. You know, you just start to feel differently about it. And um, one other thing before we wrap this video up, I will be posting this case combo on my Rex Lace Keychain website soon along with all of my old cases because I will be getting a new iPhone. So I will have no purpose for these anymore. So if y'all do want to get these, everything will be severely marked down obviously because you know, used and i'm not sure how many people get a new iphone so with that being said let's get ready and wrap up today's updated review in the next clip so if you make it to the end of today's video yes i see you and yes i do appreciate you if y'all want to see more content just like this from me on my channel in the future y'all know what y'all need to be doing y'all start to y'all to the beginning which you know love many y'all at the end do not forget to go ahead and give uh, this video just let me know what y'all are interested in this type of content here on my channel and y'all definitely should see some more in the future it will also help push me and my channel to our audience so we can hit our next subscriber go here on youtube also y'all know the drill y'all know what's coming next do not forget to go ahead and subscribe below because you already know i do post once a week and i never ever 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 miss the upload yes y'all can come on fact check me on the head but before i let y'all go i have to let y'all know that i do love and appreciate every single last heart here on my channel y'all know y'all forever in my heart and i will see y'all in my next upload bye y'all